Okay, so I was doing a um, research video about Papa Legba after that dream I had with him that I told you about on my channel in one of the videos on here. And I was just thinking, I googled him and this is one of the links that came up. It's for a co Halloween costume of him and I'm kind of offended and I'm not from the... I mean, he doesn't really look like that. So I'm kind of like offended by that because... Um, just like why do we have to make spirits like a Halloween costume I feel like it's like kind of offensive and is that is supposed to be what what is that supposed to be like snakes or skin or something because it reminds me of like a snake doesn't it like or a python but that's kind of like cool though oh the, there's a snake look on the handle he doesn't look too happy to and you can zoom in I don't know why but I, that's kind of cool feature that they have he doesn't act, I don't think he has the, the actual Papa Leg, but has actual skulls on his hat. Um, or an X on his forehead. Or powder all over his face. Um, but in the dream, I didn't get that close to him, so I can't be sure. And I don't think he wears gloves either. And I don't get why people wear gloves like this. Is there a reason? Can you tell me why you wear gloves like this, but you leave the fingers out? Like, can you, can you tell me why you guys do that? Because I don't understand. And I've tried to for years, like, and I will never wear gloves like that, but just explain to me why people do that. Is it a style? And when did it catch on and why? So, yeah, so there's a Papa Legba Halloween costume now. I'm kind of offended. I'm not even from, like, a, I, I did research about Papa Legba, and this was, like, one of the last things that popped up. I'm wondering if anyone's going to actually go as him or not. Um... That's a really good model, though, I will say. Like, I'm not I'm not bashing the actual model, but I just don't think... And it's only what? It says how, how expensive is this costume. Oh, you can also... It's actually 40, only 45 bucks, you guys. Like, like someone's going to spend that much money on a costume. Oh, it's out of stock. It's out of stock. American Horror Story Papa Legba men's costume. It's out of stock. So, actually, a lot of people liked it then. They must really like Papa Legba then. He must be more popular than I thought he was. And that's not a dig on Papa Legba. I'm just like, I just like honestly didn't. I don't know much about the voodoo culture. I wasn't, I'm not, I wasn't brought up into like a witchcraft really. And I wasn't brought up into like voodoo culture. So, or about like loas. Because I guess there's different loas. And Papa Legba is one of them. Um, some people claim he's like for like, he's like a crossroads spirit. I might do another more research video about him in the future. I was just really kind of like, I think it's a cool costume, don't get me wrong, but like, I'm just kind of like, we're really like heading in a new direction now. Like, and I thought it was cool he was on American Horror Story, like I wasn't offended, but I'm, I'm more offended that there's a costume of him. But I guess I feel like a spirit wouldn't really be offended by that. He just feel like flattered. But I don't know. I can't talk for him. I'm just like, I'm just like I just like I just it's like, like someone made a Jesus costume. Like it would just be like it would be so, it would be, it would it would be so offensive to me if someone made a if someone went as Jesus, for Halloween. I would be so offended. It's kind of similar to that. Um. Because it's just like, I mean, Jesus was a cool guy, but it would just be a bad idea for a costume. You know what I'm saying? And I feel like that's kind of like similar to this situation here. Like, it's kind of, it's a thin line between um, offensive nature of something. And I feel like this is kind of like sk like skating on thin ice when they do stuff like this. Um, when they make like costumes of like, possibly demonic spirits I could be wrong maybe he's not a demonic spirit because like I said I don't know much about the voodoo culture but I'm just saying like I just wouldn't want to wear that outfit well because I'm not a man but like I'm just I think the gloves mostly I'm offended by actually so yeah I hope you enjoyed this video have a have a happy and and safe have happy and safe Halloween everyone